and four of the ten trips to the NCAA tournament. Tough to get it inbounds and plucked away by Moore in transition. Nice dish and Miller to finish that. It absolutely will, Obi, but part of it is, you know, many of these are unfortunate. Oh, woo -hoo. my goodness. Mamadou Keen out of nowhere. Garland, the DePaul graduate, lost his footing, got it back and made the shot. Hortberg does a lot of the little things. A lot of their offense functions through him, doesn't it? Yeah, Jeff Capel was very concerned about him. You see another beautiful five. But a great block by Burton to take away the dunk from Bensley Joseph. Wardenberg won't shoot it. Shot clock at nine. Here's McGusty. We'll lift that one and knock it down from three-point line. We'll go Poplar into the game. Actual first name is Nicene. And my goodness. <laughs> my goodness is correct. Jim Laranega has to be comfortable with the basketball in each of their hands. Over for the corner, McGusty. Yes, he drills a three. Wardenberg is the lane opens up and he slams it down. Which is the reason why you get the clock one. Vaughn on a nifty spin, slams on the brakes. Yes, so he's made some pretty shots. Well, and that's what he does. Strong rebound by Walker on that possession, going up against Ugly, who probably outweighs him 50 pounds. But yet Walker's athleticism allows him to be his bigger plays. That nice Jordan Miller. What an array of skills the junior. But oftentimes he's playing against double teams, but they're not a great shooting team to force O. Wardenberg left once again to go all the way to the iron and slams it down. And now Wong as we approach the eight-minute mark. Dusty shredding everybody to lay in two. And he puts the brakes on it. And that's going to put an end to the ball game. 85-64 will be the final Miami in the win column again. 220 wins at the school.